Have you ever wondered how a slimy, water-dwelling creature can generate a shock that can knock a horse off its feet? Yes, we're talking about the electric eel, a creature that has intrigued and baffled scientists for centuries. Despite their name, electric eels are not actually eels. They're more closely related to catfish and carp, but their elongated shape and slippery skin have earned them their eel-like moniker. These fascinating creatures reside in the murky waters of South America's Amazon and Orinoco River basins, a world far removed from our own. Yet they're not your average fish. Electric eels are equipped with a unique ability that sets them apart from the rest of the aquatic world. They can generate substantial electric shocks. This extraordinary power is not just a party trick, but a crucial part of their survival strategy in the wild. Electric eels use this shocking ability for navigation, hunting and self-defense. Their bodies contain specialized cells called electrocytes, stacked like batteries in a flashlight. When an electric eel decides it's time to unleash a shock, a message from the brain tells these cells to open their ion channels. This lets positively charged sodium ions rush in, creating a sudden and powerful voltage. Just to give you a sense of the force we're talking about, an electric eel's shock can reach up to 600 volts. That's five times the power of a standard American wall socket and enough to cause serious harm to potential predators or prey. From horses to humans, few creatures can withstand this kind of jolt without feeling the effects. But don't let this scare you off. Understanding these creatures and their shocking abilities helps us appreciate the diversity and adaptability of life on our planet. It's a testament to nature's ingenuity, showing us that even in the seemingly tranquil waters of a river, there can be an electrifying secret lurking beneath the surface. The fascinating world of electric eels is filled with shocking surprises, so brace yourself for an electrifying journey. Now, how do these seemingly innocuous creatures generate electricity? Electric eels with their slimy, elongated bodies may not look like much of a threat, but they hold a secret superpower, the ability to generate electricity. This electrifying phenomenon begins with the eel's specialized cells known as electrocytes. These are disc-shaped cells that are stacked much like coins in a roll, and they make up about four-fifths of the eel's body. Now imagine these electrocytes as miniature batteries. Each one carries a small charge. In isolation this charge is minuscule, hardly enough to light up a bulb. But when these cells act in concert, the effect is truly shocking. Just as a stack of batteries can power a torch, a series of electrocytes can deliver a jolt powerful enough to stun a horse. So, how does this happen? Well, when an electric eel senses prey or feels threatened, a signal from its brain triggers the opening of ion channels in the electrocytes. This allows positively charged sodium ions to flow in, reversing the polarity of each cell. This sudden shift creates a current, and voila, a shock is produced. The eel's body acts as a conduit, allowing this charge to flow from the head, where the positive pole is located, to the tail, which acts as the negative pole. This creates an electric field around the eel, which it uses to navigate, communicate, and most importantly, to defend itself and capture prey. While this might seem like a lot of work for a meal or a bit of self-defense, it's actually quite efficient. The eel can deliver a series of shocks in rapid succession, enough to stun or deter most predators. And when it comes to hunting, the eel's shock strategy is a surefire way to stop its prey in its tracks. So, the next time you switch on a light, remember the electric eel, nature's living power generator. This remarkable creature has mastered the art of electricity in a way that no other animal has, turning a simple biological function into a potent weapon and a sophisticated tool for survival. Don't get too comfortable though, the electric eel's shock is no simple spark. Indeed, it's a formidable weapon in the aquatic world, a living testament to the marvels of evolution. The electric eel's shock isn't just potent, it's also incredibly versatile, serving three major purposes, navigation, hunting, and self-defense. Let's start with navigation. In the murkiness of their freshwater habitats, sight isn't always reliable. So, electric eels have developed a unique way to navigate their surroundings. They emit low-level electric discharges, creating an electric field around them. Any changes in this field, caused by the presence of objects or other animals, provide the eel with a detailed understanding of its environment. It's like having a sixth sense or a built-in GPS, if you will. Next up is hunting. When it's time to dine, the electric eel steps it up a notch. It uses high-voltage shocks to stun or kill its prey. Imagine a fish swimming along, minding its own business when suddenly it's hit with a shock of up to 600 volts. 
That's five times the power of a standard household outlet. Talk about a shocking meal. Lastly, the electric eel uses its shock for self-defense. It's a deterrent against predators and a stern warning to those who would dare to threaten it. From inquisitive caimans to daring jaguars, any creature that tries to make a meal of an electric eel is in for a rude awakening. Yet, despite its strength, the electric eel's shock is usually not lethal to humans. It might knock you off your feet, leaving you dazed and confused, but it rarely causes serious harm. However, it's worth noting that there have been instances where the shock has led to heart failure or drowning. So, while it may not be a pleasant experience, receiving a shock from an electric eel is a fascinating demonstration of nature's power. It's a reminder of the intricate and often unseen dangers lurking in our world's waterways, and a testament to the stunning adaptability of life on Earth. But what happens when an eel, armed with this electric power, comes face to face with unsuspecting predators? It's a question that might make your hair stand on end, and for good reason. Imagine a quiet water body, teeming with life, suddenly disrupted by the menacing silhouette of an alligator. It's on the hunt, but little does it know that its usual prey hides a shocking secret. Enter the electric eel. Not your everyday fish, this creature boasts an arsenal of electrical power that can deliver a jolt of up to 600 volts. That's five times the power of a standard US wall socket. Now the alligator might be a powerhouse in its own right, but against the electric eel, it's in for a shocking surprise. There have been cases where alligators, in their pursuit of a seemingly easy meal, have been electrocuted, paralyzed, and even killed by the eel's electric discharge. Talk about a shocking turn of events. And it's not just alligators that need to be wary of these electrifying creatures. Even the elusive leopard, a predator at the top of the food chain, isn't immune to the eel's electric prowess. Picture a leopard, stealthily approaching the water's edge, eyes fixated on the eel. In an instant, the eel sends out a high-voltage shock, leaving the big cat momentarily stunned and retreating to the safety of the jungle. These encounters showcase the incredible defensive capabilities of electric eels. But it's not all about defense. Electric eels also use their power to navigate, communicate, and locate prey in their murky aquatic homes. It's a fascinating blend of power and precision, of shock and survival. So the next time you think of underwater predators, remember the electric eel. It may not have the size of a shark or the teeth of a crocodile, but with its electric power, it stands tall among the most formidable creatures of the deep. The electric eel, it seems, is not a creature to be underestimated. So, how dangerous is the electric eel's shock to humans? This is a question that has fascinated and frightened many. The answer, as with most things in nature, is a mix of simple and complex. The electric eel's shock, while certainly powerful, is not typically fatal to humans. However, that's not to say it's a pleasant experience. Those who have been on the receiving end of an electric eel's shock describe it as a strong, painful jolt. There have been a few recorded incidents of humans being seriously injured by electric eels. Most often these injuries are indirect. The shock might cause a person to fall or lose consciousness, leading to other accidents. In one notable case, a man was shocked into unconsciousness while wading in a South American river and subsequently drowned. Scientists have studied the eel's electric shock in an attempt to understand its power and potential. They've found that an electric eel can generate a shock of up to 600 volts. That's five times the power of a standard American wall socket. But it's not just the strength of the shock that's impressive, it's also the speed. An electric eel can deliver its powerful jolt in just two thousandths of a second. And yet, despite the power of this shock, most humans who encounter an electric eel will walk away with nothing more than a painful memory. The eel's shock is designed to stun or ward off predators, not to kill. So what about other animals? Well, the story is a bit different. For smaller creatures, the electric eel's shock can be lethal. Larger animals like crocodiles or jaguars can also be seriously injured. The shock can stun them, giving the eel a chance to escape or even turn the tables on its attacker. In the end, while the electric eel's shock may be powerful and potentially dangerous, it is also a remarkable testament to the wonders and mysteries of nature.